This is post eating fried rice. It's all gone. And I read somewhere, but I've never done it before in my life, life hacks. I didn't think about it, but let's do it now together. You take this container apart, and apparently you can eat on it like it's a takeout plate. I don't know how we're going to do this. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's do it together. Okay, how am I going to set the camera up to where you guys can see this? Apparently we have to get this silver thing out of here first, this metal thing. But once we pry it open, we can use it as a plate. I won't be able to this time because I already finished all the rice, but here, let's see. If you can still see what I'm doing. Can you hear me? Can you see me? I'm just going to yank it off of there a little bit, you know what I mean? I don't want to hurt my hands. They're very sensitive and fragile. I don't have the strongest, toughest hands, you know? I don't have, I don't have a man's hands. I'm not trying to be stereotypical, I just have very weak hands. I know some men who do too. That's one of my exes. Anyways, let's try to pry this off without flinging this in my face. I tend to be very clumsy. I could see myself flinging this in my face or my eyes. Okay, let's see. How are we going to? I could just kind of pull it out. Okay. Let's see. Unfold it. Here's the anticipation. Oh my goodness. I've never done this in my life. You're supposed to be able to open it, and it's a plate. I can't even tell how this would be a plate. It's not a very economical plate. It's not very convenient, is it? It's so weird. It's like, if I open it and I put the rice in here, or leave the rice in here, it's a big mound of rice, imagine that, and then I eat it. So weird, right? I don't know if I like doing that. Well, that was a life hack, so I'll see if I can come up with more life hacks and see if they actually work or disproving life hacks. Now, a lot of people may comment on this video, oh, we can make it work, we can spread out the plate, we can, you know, but re remember, the rice is already in there when you get it, so am I supposed to ask for another empty box, you know, that might lay flatter and might have less rice on it to begin with, and I'm pouring rice from one container into another? I don't know. That doesn't look economical to me. It doesn't look practical at all. So, and I can't show you what my fortune is or it won't come true. So I'm going to open this now, but I'm not going to tell you what my fortune is. Hopefully for the new year it's good. Today's January 2nd, 2019. I keep thinking it's still 2018. <coughs> okay. Alright. So, I'm going to go eat this. A lot of people just break them open and you get their fortunes out, but I actually like to eat these. So. I was recently watching Walking and Talking, the sister or brother channel of Sitting and Smiling. And I think he has a lot of great ideas for videos. Alright guys, have a great day. I'm probably actually going to go ahead and make more videos and put them out soon. Put some out. I still need to put my ice cream video out. You guys are going to love that. Where I got this huge plate of ice cream. It's like three gallons. It was in this bag. Alright guys, take it easy. I have to move my phone wire. It's soaked in soy sauce. So I better go and clean. Oh no, my phone table's all soaked in soy sauce. Gross. Ooh, look, it spilled all over everything. Alright, have a good day, guys. Bye.